Good evening, I'm Ted Smith. Tonight we come on the air with breaking news regarding the Tom Robinson trial. We've just learned that he's been convicted of raping Mayela Yule. Let's go live now to Action News 7 reporter Steve Lynch. He's live outside the Macomb County Courthouse with the latest on this story. Steve. That's right. Tonight, a verdict has been reached in Tom Robinson's trial. A jury has found him guilty of raping the yellow Yule. Oh, wait. Here's Mr. Gilmer, the victim attorney now. Mr. Gilmer, can I ask you two questions? Sir, what can you tell us about the case? I'll tell you that things went exactly as I expected. My client, poor Mayella, was most definitely raped by that Tom Robinson. Ain't no question about it. Sir, do you think there's enough evidence to prove Tom Robinson guilty? Absolutely. There ain't no way in hell that that lying bastard was going to get away with this. Just look at Bob Buell's testimony. He saw it all from the window. Tom Robinson was all up on his man and you. Thank you, Mr. Gilmer, for your time. Back to you, Ted. Thanks, Steve. Before we end, here's what's coming up on next week's show. The cause of Miss Maudie's house fire. I've just been informed that Tom Robinson has been killed at the Macomb County Jail. Uh, we have reporter Steve Lynch, who's outside the prison with more tonight. Steve. Thanks, Ted. <laughs> I'm here with the officer from the prison now. Sir, can you tell us what happened here? Well, I saw that Tom Robinson fella trying to escape my prison. So, I took out my gun and I shot him not once, not twice, but 17 times. Sir, people in Macomb believe that killing a cripple is a sin. How do you feel? He was crippled? Uh, uh, back to you, Ted. Thanks, Steve. That's all the time we have for tonight. We'll be back next week when we interview Macomb residents who think Hitler is evil. Unexpected death of Bob Yule. Steve Lynch is live at the scene. Thank you, Ted. My cameraman and I were at, sc at the school covering the Macomb County pageant. At the conclusion of the event, we saw what appeared to be a man on the ground lying by a tree. As we went closer, we identified the man as Bob Yule lying face down with a knife inside his rib. Sheriff Tate was at the scene when we arrived. Heck, do you have any idea of how he died? He fell on his knife, that's all. The scene resemb resembles a struggle. Also, a piece of chicken wire was found feet away from the scene. Any input on that? Can't reveal any further information right now. All right, back to you, Ted. Thanks, Please. Steve. That wraps up this week's edition of Action News 7. Thank you, stay safe, and good night. <laughs>